Hi, this is Ingrid Donovan. I want to talk briefly about uh, FPS, frames per second. Um, and in the top right corner of your uh, Firestorm viewer, if you use Firestorm, you'll see a number, 20, and you'll see a little um, uh, green, and sometimes it'll turn red, bar going up. Um, I could go to other sims and show you this, but then I would be breaking some terms, Linden terms, and so I'm not going to do that. Um, my land's actually pretty stable, but at times it does spike. Um, but I spike, especially every time I teleport. I think everybody does, and there's nothing you can do about that. But there's a simple little trick that you can do um, to keep your frame uh, frames per second low. Um, and you'll want to do that, especially like if you're going to be going to a very laggy place and you'll want to be able to walk around. You don't want your computer overheating because that's one of the things is that it, it, it the higher the frames per second, the more taxing it is on your graphics driver. The more energy that's consumed by your um, driver, the more heat that it produces. Um, and when you lower it, your cooling fan runs slower. Um, there's a lot of different benefits. And online, there's a thousand different things about what people say can and can't be. But let's just go right into the skinny. Go to Avatar. Go to Preferences. At the top, just type in FPS. Whoops. FPS. And you will see it under Graphics Rendering. You'll see it right here. It's in red. Limit frame rate. Click that. Linden Labs has it set for 120. Um, generally, if you were doing a video or you're doing a photo shoot, but shoot and you have your graphics set really high, um, you'll want to keep it high, especially if you're doing video. Um, if you're just walking around, you can go around 80 and hit the limit frame rate, set it to around 80, and you know that you really won't notice the difference in world. I have to be honest with you. I bring mine down to about 30. And why? Well, most of the time I'm tired after a while in SL, and I don't really actually notice it myself. I usually keep my graphics um, low um, especially because I go into some really heavy, heavy textured and, and scripted areas. And uh, I want to be able to move around. I want to be able to see things and I want to be able to see them quickly. And I don't want to freeze. I don't want my computer overheating. So I kind of keep it there. And when I do do video and I do um, uh, photo work, I will bring it up. But of course, at that point, I will also bring up my um, graphic driver settings. I, uh, my so the settings in the, the, the graphics. Um, right now I think I have it set to the medium, um, the mid. Uh, but, you know, if you bring it up to ultra, but that's, this is my opinion. I would say bring that, that, that FPS down. Now it's not going to go above 30. Um, and there have been times when I've dropped it down to 24 just because uh, of where I'm at. Um, but when you do teleport, you do you will see it still spike. It will spike um, no matter what when you teleport. Um, but that's how to limit frames per second.